Hello guys and welcome back. In this video I'm going to show you how to make a tool uh, with my mod tool. Uh, if you're watching this I'm going to assume you've already set up the Minecraft Coder Pack. Uh, the link will be on screen if you want to watch that video. I would recommend you do if you haven't already. So what we're going to do in this video is we're going to make a tool. So you need to go into your MCP folder and run the exe. And it should come up with this. It'll say tools. So the collective name for your set of mods, uh, I'm just going to make uh, a dirt tools mod because it's really simple. So dirt tools. Then the name for this tool, so I'm going to make a dirt pickaxe, which is of type pickaxe and it'll have the same durability as diamond. Now choose an item ID. Uh, I'm going to go with foo, 1291. No, I'm not. <laughs> 1291. There we go. Okay, uh, now we're going to select a texture file. Um, desktop. I've already made some textures here. Um, I may put a download to some textures that I've already made in the description if you want to get those. I did forget to mention actually the download for all of these. Uh, things that you need will be in the description. So this is the pickaxe. We're going to select dirt pickaxe and open. And it will change this to dirt pickaxe.png. Now our tool does have a recipe, so you don't need to click that button. Um, so from there we go, we scroll down and we look for dirt. Um, just gone past it in the blocks column. So we click dirt, dirt, and dirt. Nope, dirt. Okay, <laughs> and now we need to look for sticks. So that'll be quite near the bottom. S S. Uh, shout if you see sticks. Ah, there we go. Sticks. Okay, stick and stick, and that's everything filled in. So click add new item. Uh, next, we will make a dirt spade. So it's type spade. Um, um, we'll make this one as strong as wood. I'll just show you the difference. Uh, select file and dirt spade. Open. And then for the recipe, one dirt block and two sticks. So we've filled in everything and then we're going to click add new item. And it's that simple really, we just click finish. Saved as mod dirt tools. Okay. Now we're going to our MCP setup and click recompile. And wait for the recompile to finish, this usually takes about 6 seconds. There we go, done in 6.61 .6 seconds. So we can now start the client. And this loads up Minecraft, so we need to load a world first, create a new world. Okay, so this is our Minecraft world. Uh, so we need to collect uh, four dirt blocks. Oh, that's five. Okay. <laughs> five dirt blocks. And we'll go and collect some wood. Uh, we need two wood because we need to make a crafting bench as well. Okay, and now we just open up the inventory. Wooden planks, one crafting bench, and some sticks. And just place down your crafting bench. And there we go, our dirt pickaxe. <laughs> Which I've spelt wrong. Okay, dirt pickaxe and a dirt spade. So I'll just show you. Uh, this is the normal fist breaking grass. And this is the spade. As you can see it's just slightly faster, but it's only based on wood, so it, it's pretty slow. But uh, here's the normal fist breaking stone. And here's the pickaxe breaking stone. 
So as you can see, it's got the same attributes as Diamond. It's it's very good. Uh, same durability as Diamond. There will be updates in the future that will allow you to specify your own durability, but um, as it says on the post, this is just a beta release. This is to test bugs. So so don't worry if there's something that you want. You, it can still be added. Just comment on the post with what you want and I uh, will do my very best to add it into the later version. Um, okay, so now I'm going to show you how to publish your uh, mod. So we don't need this anymore. Uh, you're going to want to re-obfuscate the classes. And what this does is it turns it back into code that Minecraft can understand because Minecraft is obfuscated, which means it's put into a different type of code uh, that people can't understand or it's hard for people to understand because uh, it shortens words and things like that so it, it runs faster and uh, so people can't copy it I suppose <laughs> but uh, Minecraft Coder Pack undoes all that so nice try <laughs> okay so we're done we've re-obfuscated now we're gonna click one of these handy buttons at the bottom the one that says obfuscated classes and you just click that there and then go into the Minecraft folder and you see our all our pictures so to run these we can open our app data folder you probably already know how to do this but I'll just show you anyway and go into dot minecraft and then bin and then open your bin folder with WinRAR uh, and as you can see this isn't the new bin folder this is our original bin folder the program sorts all that out for you it it, uh, it moves them into the right places so you don't have to do any work at all and then that's it loaded up so we'll click Minecraft and then run and then log in uh, just like you would normally and then new world and there we go okay so I'll get some wood oh in fact I will use single player commands because this is my world so <laughs> I have some other mods on here but as you can see they're here dirt pickaxe and dirt spade um, your mod will work with uh, too many items and single player commands I believe <laughs> um, as you can see it's not actually dropping anything that's because I have single player commands on and I've set it so that blocks will not drop items but but that's okay it does work I promise um, so go try it out for yourself uh, that's the end of the video but thank you for watching and that is a weird tree isn't it <laughs> Yeah, but thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you get to make your own mod. Uh, enjoy. Bye. Oh, I forgot to say, please rate, comment, subscribe, etc. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.